Hey guys, Garrelis Monitoring here again. So I just got finished doing about 20 minutes of this book right here, Upgrading and Repairing PCs. Um, this book is massive. Um, honestly, if you if you don't know the first thing about computers, which I didn't when I bought this book, um, I do not recommend you buy this book because this thing is dense and full of so much technical terminology that Oh man, I can't even imagine. Uh, it's it takes it takes so much effort to keep up with the information in this book. Um, that's why I bought a second one that I read first, which is much more comprehensive, much more um, digestible, uh, as opposed to this one, which has so many terms I'm unfamiliar with. But um, the things that I did that I was able to glean from it is uh, talks about motherboards, um, and so when you when you get a motherboard, it's going to have a bunch of uh, import. Or uh, sorry, input input output ports. So they call them I/O ports, and those are basically like something. It's like you plug it in, and the information goes from and to the computer. Um, so again, that's called an I/O port. Uh, pretty much every motherboard comes with a bunch of I/O ports. Um, if the motherboard does not have I/O ports, then you're probably from the 1980s and still living there. Um, so you should probably get a new motherboard. Um, otherwise, it's got a bunch of ports on it, and it lists all the different ports, and I don't really understand what all of this means, so I'm not going to bother going over them. Um, try, we'll see. What else do they cover? Uh, also cover that most motherboards, most uh, mainstream motherboards, I suppose you could call them, uh, come with um, integrated sound and video cards. Um, so those of you who buy motherboards that are fairly mainstream, they come installed with them. Otherwise, You'd have to know what you're looking for, uh, but if you're watching this video and you already knew that, then you know more than I do, so I wouldn't worry about it too much. Uh, other than that, uh, yeah, that's about all. There's a bunch of different words here I don't understand, So, but keep trying. So uh, so that's how that goes. Now what I'm going to do is uh, I'm actually getting kind of sleepy. And when I start getting sleepy, I like to do my flashcards because um, what I do, for those of you who don't know, is I wake up early in the morning um, and I do stuff during the day. And then midday, I take a nap, uh, usually a two-hour, two, three-hour nap uh, because I found that I've always taken naps in the middle of the day. And so to compensate for that, I wake up earlier in the day because I'm going to end up taking a nap anyway. So that's why I do that. So I'm going to do my vocabulary cards while I'm starting to wind down because they require less um, – Let's uh, focus, and so um, I'll just do vocabulary cards. So I'm gonna do I'm gonna do Spanish vocabulary for the next um, probably hour and twenty minutes. So uh, yeah, so I'll watch some One Piece while I'm doing that, and yeah, um, till the next video.